How can we improve patient education for both our kidney transplant recipients and donors during this global pandemic? Previously, patients being evaluated for kidney transplant would come to Toronto General Hospital for group teaching sessions led by pre-transplant nurse coordinators and social workers. But now due to COVID-19, patient education is being conducted one-on-one -on -one through video calls. And if patients have difficulty with technology, then over the phone. Based on their experience, the pre-transplant nurse coordinators estimate that 40% of patient education has to be done over the phone, making it very time consuming. In addition, it is difficult to gauge patients' understanding of the content without being able to observe their nonverbal communication cues. Even with the ability to facilitate in-person education sessions prior to the pandemic, retention of information among patients is fairly low as existing resources are difficult to navigate. A lack of knowledge for kidney transplant candidates can make them hesitant to reach out to potential donors and barriers during the pre-transplant evaluation process inevitably slow down donor workup. To solve this problem, we proposed the Kidney Transplant Learning Project, or KTLP, a project to transform currently existing educational materials into more engaging formats. This includes creating animated videos and summary sheets and incorporating end of chapter quizzes for patients to access from home. In addition, the educational videos would have interactive components such as voiceovers and knowledge checkpoints. We hope to host these videos on a mobile or computer application. Our proposed educational resources would enable patients to assess their own knowledge and provide motivation to manage their own health. Nurse coordinators would also be able to select and recommend specific videos before and after telephone consults that are tailored to each patient. Instead of having to review a general 70-page transplant manual, patients would be able to watch the videos on their own time, including at their dialysis appointments. Translating patient educational material into interactive formats and evaluating patient knowledge through an assessment tool will be beneficial to both donors and recipients. The number of kidney transplant referrals has steadily increased, amounting to nearly 500 referrals per year in the past three years. The patient education problems that previously existed are worsened by the pandemic, and we need a team with experience making educational content to spearhead this project. Our team has experience working with nurse coordinators, social workers, physicians, and other content experts. Last summer, in support of our grant to the Canadian Society of Transplantation, we created an animated video describing the new kidney transplant evaluation process at TGH. We also have the support of pre-transplant nurse coordinators and are currently recruiting other stakeholders to review scripts and storyboards. Funding for the Kidney Transplant Learning Project will go towards compensating the time of content and video creators, as that is our primary goal. Any additional funding will go toward the creation of the platform hosting the videos and assessment tools. We envision our kidney transplant learning project to address our lack of engaging educational content and knowledge assessment tools. Patients at a world-class transplant program deserve top tier patient education. And we look forward to hearing your questions and input during the Living Donation Week 2020 Dragon's Den Pitch Showcase.